Hi everyone, welcome back to the Four and Fork YouTube channel. Today we're starting with Belize. So we are doing a rice and beans recipe from Belize. Rice and beans kind of show up a lot on my website because they tend to be a staple in a lot of different countries. But the reason I chose rice and beans for today, for this video, is because the rice and beans in Belize are very unique because they are cooked with coconut milk. So they have a really coconutty flavor to them and I'm a big fan of coconut and I love them. So I'm really excited to show you the recipe. All right, so to start off, we have one pound of red kidney beans boiling here in this pot. So to get to this point, we had one pound of dry kidney beans that last night I put in a big bowl of uh, a big bowl and then I covered them up with water so that there was about two inches of water um, above the beans. And then overnight, I let them kind of rehydrate and they swelled up a little bit. Um, they got a lot more moisture in them. Then what I did was I drained them out um, in the sink. I put them into this pot and covered them up again with quite a bit of water and I boiled them for about 40 minutes to tenderize them. So at this point, the beans are done boiling. I'm gonna turn them off and I have to drain them again. In a separate pot on the stove, we're gonna put three tablespoons of butter and let that melt in there. We've melted our three tablespoons of butter here in this pot on the stove. Now we're gonna add one cup of plain white rice. And we're just gonna stir them around into this butter and let them toast for a couple of minutes. So you don't want it to burn, you wanna keep a good eye on them, but they should be turning a little brown and that way you know that they are getting some flavor and getting ready to be boiled. So as you can see in here, our rice is starting to get little, a couple little brown pieces in there so we know that it's toasting. What we're gonna do now is we are going to add one cup of water. <laughs> and one cup of coconut milk. Into this mixture. We are also going to put one half of an onion, one half red pepper, two teaspoons salt, one teaspoon black pepper, and then our boiled red kidney beans are the last thing that we're gonna dump in there. So we're gonna mix these all together and then our mixture, we're gonna cover it up with a lid. It's going to come to a boil. Once it comes to a boil, we'll reduce it down to a simmer and then we will leave it for about 25 to 30-ish minutes until the rice cooks all the way through. You'll fluff it up with a fork and then it's ready to eat. Okay, so the rice has been simmering on the stove for about 25 to 30-ish minutes. The rice is fully cooked through. Look at that steam. Um, so I wanna try it. Scoop myself a little, little bowl here. The beans in here are really beautiful. It's held together nicely too. I feel like I gotta blow on it. Okay. <laughs> I can taste the coconut from the coconut milk. And that's my favorite part about this recipe is that you can actually taste the coconut and it is so good and so tender. If you want to see a written recipe for this recipe for rice and beans, you can head over to my blog, www.foreignfork.com. If you go to the recipe box and hit Belize, you will be able to find all the recipes from Belize, not even just the ones that are on YouTube. There's a couple other exclusive recipes on there too. So head over to my blog and thanks for stopping by. I will see you guys soon. So if you all are really liking these videos and you want to see more of them, then remember to just hit the subscribe button down there and then that way you can make sure not to miss anything else.